Good morning. It's 5 a.m. Dryer shut down. So I came here last night around 9 o'clock. Dryer shut down. Got it running again. Things are running fine. Came back around 10 o'clock. Dryer shut down. It was plugged. I tried getting it going. I was here till 10:30. Oh, Still wasn't running. Well, seems like a tomorrow problem now. So. I ended up calling my brother and said, hey, you know what? You don't have to come in uh, around midnight because it's not going to be running when you get there. So here it is, 5 a.m. I'm going to try getting it going. Uh, my pipes are plugged. Okay, remember I said it's important to run the dryer, get all that crap out of there? Well, obviously there's a few pieces still stuck in the nooks and the crannies. That's just for me washing it last year. It was all stuck in here and then it goes down in that hole and then it plugs that. That's what I'm assuming is going on, so... Get the vacuum going here. Shut loose freely. Good news is, there's lots of sensors on this thing, so it it's not like the end of the world. So actually, that tube never got plugged. I'm pretty sure it was just that to stop turning. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Ignition. Perfect. <laughs> I tried getting here at 5 a.m. I was just too tired. I had to. I had to leave. I was so frustrated because uh, it just kept shutting down and plugging. Um, there was a lot more crap sitting in all those areas I showed you last night. Anyways, we're we're going now. Uh, at least I think. <laughs> now I'm gonna sit here for an hour and just kind of babysit it. That's all part of it. Hopefully uh, we can dry a bunch today, and then uh, we'll be able to get back into the combine a little bit. 
not as much as I wanted to, but at the end of the day, it's first day problems. That's just how it goes every time, every year. Uh, once you get that first day under your belt and you get all those little kinks worked out of your system, it'll work fine. Uh, I've been very happy with this system. Um, this is light years ahead of what we were using back before 2014. Uh, so, anyways, carry on. Okay, so now that the morning things are going, I'm going to test. This is what I dried last night. Um, it is now cooled down here, nice, nice and cool. Uh, it's cooled to 16 degrees Celsius. A couple more kernels in there. So 250 is your dry. To 16. I could use a smart meter, but it's, I uh, already have the thermometer in there, so it's just quick to go. 14. What is that? 40. Sorry. Yes, 40 right here. 42 actually. Sorry, 42. 16. Uh, 14. 2. So dry is considered 15.5. This is going on the bottom of the bin. I dry it down an extra point, and I know it's gonna keep well. So everything is at least working like it's supposed to, minus the dryer shut down. Here's my mom again. Oh, you're already in the shot. No. Five o'clock, brought me coffee. Thank you. For, I guess we dried a bit of corn last night. That level just went off, so we'll uh, unload a set of wagons here in a bit. When I do, I'm gonna do a calibration of this shortly to make sure I, it's good to give it about 30, 30 minutes plus of runtime so the sensors get cleaned off and they can figure themselves out. This isn't anything fancy. I just went to the hardware store, just a strainer, flower pot, pole cut in, and a fan. But it does what I need to do.
system now. It'll stay clean. Uh, especially, we talk about some rain during this week, so all that stuff will just turn to slop. So just quickly blow it off, maybe twice a day, once a day, it doesn't matter. Uh, we want to keep those screens clean. Uh, it's more efficient that way. I can already see a little bill of a red dog up there, so let's take a broom and knock that off. Uh, anyways, that's what's going on there. My brother, he went to go grab uh, manure tank. We got to spread manure. Good to go. One o'clock, it's go time. Gonna get a set of wagons. Two sets of wagons down there. Owen's gonna pick us up. Come back. Last set of wagons, plus buggy and combine. <sighs> Won't be able to go as hard as we did yesterday because the wet bin is still pretty well full. Um, just because we didn't get the dry last night, but we'll still get a bunch done. Let's go. So please, if you see us on the road, slow down, take your time, look what's going on around. I'm telling you, I see people almost getting accidents all the time. I'm just trying to do a job. I'm sorry I'm slowing you down, but this has to get done. So I apologize. But please, take your time when you see the flashing lights and the caution sign. Coming to get us parking. I don't know if one's gonna come, but uh, oh, he's gonna come inside me. No, right behind me. Here we go. pass you guys off to west i'm going back to the dryer enjoy A full wet bit. Close that. Bow, bow. Well, that's the night. We are full. We'll keep coming back during the night to check. Make sure the dryer's drying. Not like last night. Peace. 11 o'clock. Call it a night. <laughs> 